Sudan. Since 1952, this enormous African country has been struck by a civil war between the North and the South. One of the horrible consequences of this war is the revival of slavery. So there were, what, 414 slaves, so uh, it's 20,700, uh, 20, 20, Sudanese pounds that we owe you. Or put it in his, okay, that's five million. That's five. The American John Eibner, who represents CSI, the Swiss organization Christian Solidarity Six International, million. travels about six times a year to South Sudan. During his visits, he buys back the freedom of women and children that have been enslaved. Okay, Noor. Okay, shukran. I have known many relief workers in the South who are not willing to talk about it uh, publicly or talk to the press about it, but uh, who have um, been aware of and witnessed uh, transactions in which the local authorities were palming off as uh, slaves, uh, children who had never in fact been enslaved, uh, so that they also got a cut of the money. Wherever we go, you know, the chiefs, the religious leaders, uh, mothers and fathers uh, come up to us and thank us for the work that we're doing encourage, and encourage us to continue. Most of the NGOs who are critics never come up here. Why, should, why do you assume that NGOs should know everything? A lot of them are very, very ignorant.